Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's Jess here and Scarlett will be in the background. She hasn't stopped talking already. <laughs> I don't know if she's worn out yet, but I don't know. She's not. <laughs> anyway, so today I thought I'd make a fun video and I do half my face Instagram makeup and then the other half, other half. Give me a second. Okay. <laughs> So I was thinking of doing half this side Instagram makeup and then half this side like every day what I actually would wear out makeup. You can't really believe everything you see on Instagram videos because they are like more fun videos and also you have to remember that we have artificial lighting and all that kind of stuff so sometimes you apply more so it can look better on camera so just keep that in mind um plus obviously editing and stuff i personally don't edit on any of my videos um or photos if you didn't know that on my instagram i will put a little photo here so i don't edit i don't edit i don't edit any of these <laughs> the reason that i have no edits on my Instagram is because I did a poll a while ago and I asked everyone if they liked me continually like editing my photos a little bit rather than me not. I want you guys to feel like when you come to my page what you see is what you get. Um, sometimes I do photo shoots and obviously they will retouch but there are a lot of photo shoots I ask the photographers not to touch any of the photos. Um, so I just try to keep it as real as I can on Instagram so I mean in real life as well obviously, <laughs> that's most important. So Instagram face, everyday face, just remember. So I've just taken some on the back of my hand and on my actual side I'm just going to apply a little bit as I would, but then and I'm just like a little bit on my nose. And then on this side, we're going to go ham because I feel like this is what you see when, you know, when you go on Instagram videos, you see them go like, and then they... Come on. So I'm getting some of the Born This Way concealer. And for this eye, because you always see them go crazy, right? And then on this eye, I'm just going to like, do you see the difference? So... And usually I use a primer, but um, mine ran out and I haven't got on the order yet. So I'm going to take my little flat brush and just put that everywhere. I think I even put a bit too much on this eye. That's okay. Okay, so I just had a little epiphany of what I'm going to do. Getting this ColourPop palette. I'm starting off with the light brown shade. And then I'm just actually going to be packing that all on my lid. These ColourPop palettes are so pigmented. Um, so wow. I'm just dipping into that darker brown shade now. And with this shade, I'm just going to start popping that only on the outer part and I'm gonna focus like on blending that out and giving myself more of a defined eye. Now I'm taking a really little brush from Morphe. This is the M213 and the Helen E Cosmetics Neon Yellow Shade. For this eye, I wanna do something similar, just obviously not as dramatic. So I'm going to go in again with my transition shade and I'm going to go a bit lighter and I'm just going to kind of messily place that around here. I'm obviously not going to go as smoky as the other side because this is a everyday look. Now I'm taking that deeper brown shade. And I'm just going to pop that like on the outer half of my eye. And I'm really not going to bring that too far up because 
when you do blend it it is going to go higher and i don't want it to go too high up to my brow this is like a natural look so just i'm just going to take this little brush and blend it out so i'm really just going to leave it like that and i'm just taking my black liner and i'm just going to quickly do a little line I'm just gonna go ahead and pop on some individual lashes, curl them, put some mascara on, and then let's get to the rest of the face. So I'm gonna use the Gerard Cosmetics Bridget Illuminator, and this is one of my favorite ones. I do have a discount code that I will link here. If you want to use it, it's 30% off. So I'm just gonna go in the back of my hand, and I'm actually gonna take a pump and a half. For my actual side, I'm just gonna apply a little bit here. It's a bit much, but anyway and a little bit of my forehead, my nose and my chin. That's all I'm applying for this side. It's gonna quickly blend that out. Like you see this everywhere, like people just. I'm gonna go ahead and use this BYS Glass Glow. And I'm, oh, 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 whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm taking both of these shades. This is, sand beige and natural beige because I feel like I'm a mixture in between so I'm popping I'm using this Zoeva silk finish 102 brush and I'm just taking a little bit on the back of my brush and I'm going to start off with this side and I like to focus this more in the middle and I'm just going to start buffing I'm going in with way more and basically I'm just gonna now I'm going in with concealer I'm taking the born this way for this eye I'm just putting a dot there a dot there and I just put a little bit there because I have a lot of colors there I'm going in with the darker concealer and I'm popping that as well just there and I'm popping that a little bit on my nose and a bit on my chin and forehead and I like to use this because it's closer to my skin tone to just conceal and that's the tart one now for this side girl I'm taking the born this way concealer I'm gonna I'm taking this Anne has a variety brush F05. I love this brush and I'm gonna use this to stamp on the product. I'm just now do you see how much already that has just given me? Do you see? So for this side I'm using my Nikita Joy sponge and I'm just gonna start by pressing this down I'm not even gonna lie because I do this too, <laughs> but let's do it. So for like usually, especially on clients, I never put a stick on their face. I always like mix it in the back of my hand and then I go in. So for my Instagram side, we're just gonna go crazy and I'm actually gonna connect that to my brow. I do like actual dots you know and I only put it there I only put a bit dot a few dots and I very like lightly so I'm taking my little brush this is from real techniques and I'm just gonna go ahead and blend this out Blend this side out now. Taking the hourglass powder, taking my beauty blender and like everyone knows the Instagram brow. It's pretty like a bold, thick brow, and it kind of reaches the whole way. I feel like that's one thing I never really done was like a big thick brow. Hey 
Okay, so brows are done. Face is pretty much done. In with the Fenty Beauty um, bronzer. So the dab and roll, guys. Dab, roll. So on the Instagram side, I'm putting a bit more, and I'm gonna dab way more because we're Instagram girls. So for this side, I'm just popping it there. Then for the other side, I'm just gonna go in a bit more. Now for this lash, I'm going in with the lighter shade and I'm just gonna pop that below. Now for the natural side, I'm just popping that light shade in my eye because I feel like it really does make such a difference. I'm taking this OPV Metal Liquid Glitter. So that's how that eye is looking and I'm kind of feeling it. I'm just going to keep this very nude. I'm going in with the Essence. So. This side I did overline a bit more because I feel like, you know, you can really overline so much, especially if you're only doing photos and videos. Like, it's not as noticeable. Alright, everyone, this is the final result. Woo! This <laughs> natural ish glam, um, everyday glam that you can wear out. Realistically, you can wear both looks out. Then you got this side. Nothing wrong with this side, absolutely. But you've got more overdrawn lips. I guess you've got more of a crazy eye look. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Um, if you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. I hope you learned a little bit about Instagram makeup versus everyday makeup. Um, if you want to see more videos on little things like this, leave me a comment down below and make sure to hit that subscribe button and a big thumbs up. Thanks guys. Bye.